Hey guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes and I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise. Today I got a really quick message and this one's going to be for Libra. Can I get one card please for Libra? Let me see what the energy is happening with Libra, please. One card and one card only. One card and one card only, please, for Libra. Ooh, Libra, you seem you seem happy but bored. I feel like life is boring you. Okay, you could be connecting with a, a cancer. They're boring to you. They're a homebody or they're just boring. <laughs> I feel if this is not that you're connecting with someone that's boring, I feel like today is just a boring ass day. It's a nice sunny day, but there's nothing to do. You want to do something, but there's literally nothing to do. Okay, but moving on. Can I get cards, please, for Libra? Libra, please. The card that came out is the Eight of Cups. So, okay, so I feel like, um, yeah, I feel like you're not letting anything get you down. You're not feeling negative. You're not feeling anything. You're feeling quite jolly. You feel like you can go for a walk. You know that today is a nice fucking day. You have nothing on your fucking mind at all. Nine of swords in reverse. Nothing is stressing you out. Okay, someone could be trying to instill negativity on you. But I feel like in the end of the day, this could be possibly a Sagittarius. I feel like you're going to let that shit go. You're not going to let anything get to you. You're just going to walk away. Like I said, I feel like someone could be possibly doing something out of boredom. If this isn't you, this is someone else. It could be a fucking a Pisces, okay? They 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 <laughs> they may be a troublemaker because they're fucking bored, okay? Um, but it's not to worry. Let me pick this up. I'm not really getting I'm also getting like someone here uses the day to like... Um, like smoke all day, that may get you irritated. Like you, you don't, you're not doing anything. You just sit on your ass, do nothing all day. You could be um, dealing with a Leo. Okay. If it's not a Sagittarius, I feel like that irritates you, but you're just not going to let it get to you. You're going to walk away. You're going to let it go. Okay. Moving on. Yeah. I feel like someone sits on their ass all fucking day. Definitely is a fire sign. Can I get a card please for uh, Libra? Libra. Okay, so divine timings. Okay, the lover's card. Okay, love. Okay, so I'm getting something about love here. You're in love with the fire sign or you're in love with a Gemini. Okay, I'm also getting that you're going to reunite with someone. Okay, I'm, I'm getting, I'm hearing like a long time friend or someone that you haven't seen, seen in a while. It could possibly be a Capricorn. Okay, I feel like someone here, you're going to see someone possibly, I don't know. I don't want to give you a timeline, but I do feel like you're going to meet up with someone again. Okay. Why is a lover's card here? Please for Libra. I feel like Libra, you're going to feel inspired to, um, to, to like, I guess, date or meet people. You're going to feel very, very friendly in the next couple of days. I feel like love is also going to be something that's on your mind. Okay, Libra. Hmm. I'm also getting Libra. You keep thinking about someone's gen genitalia. So I feel like you keep thinking about someone's phallus, how big it is, what they do with it, how how good can they fuck or when they fucked you or something like that. I feel like this is what you're thinking about. If this is not you, this is that Gemini or Scorpio. Like I said, it could be any fucking body, but I feel like someone is thinking about having sex with you or, or how your sex was. Okay, I'm also getting like someone is going to feel the desire to be extremely flirtatious with you or they want to romance you. Okay, someone here may ask you out on a date as well. I feel like um, you should take the day. Don't resist them. I feel like it could possibly be a really strong connection. I, I feel like someone here is to me, the, the lover's card is not a soulmate card. It's a twin flame card for me. But anyways, yeah. Okay, so yeah, something's going to happen unexpectedly. The Ten of Pentacles. Okay, so I'm also getting if you are single Libra, love is going to happen when you least expect it okay i feel like i feel like you possibly were already in a twin flame con connection it was a disaster this person exacerbated you with um out of money they fucking hurt your heart i feel like they they had secrets they hid a lot from you okay so the next relationship that's coming up i feel like it's not going to be anything like that okay you're going to feel very secure with this person you're going to feel very like um connected. I feel like someone here is going to have the same type of spirit that you've been trying to manifest this whole time. You could be getting ready to connect with a fucking, um, I know the 10 of Pentacles is a Virgo card, but I'm hearing, I'm hearing, um, I'm hearing Capricorn. I'm also getting something about the sex. The sex will be amazing too. I'm also getting like Libra. If you have been stressing about Money issues. I feel like money is about to come. So be ex, be ex. I'm not. I don't want to say expect money, but I want to say accept anything that's giving to you. 
I'm also hearing expect money in unexpected ways and expected ways. I'm also hearing listen to affirmations for some reason. If you want to manifest more money and you're having a hard time manifesting, listen to affirmations that will help you manifest more money. I feel like that. I'm also getting something about a ficus tree. Invest in the ficus tree. If you know how to plant, you can plant one yourself and put your intentions in that. Okay, Libra. But I feel like I feel like expect the unexpected, okay? For the next I'm giving I'm gonna give you a timeline. For the next two to ten months, expect the unexpected, okay? I feel like you're gonna be meeting people, you're gonna be going places that you like you never thought that you would have a good time at or go, okay? I feel like something here is made to make you happy or is made to help you get over some type of fear. But I feel like everything is in, in due timing or everything is in alignment for you. I feel like a lot of connections as well. You may find yourself connecting a lot with earth signs and air signs i feel like that's what you're supposed to be doing right now i, I feel like i could be reading for a libra that that's that was connecting with a lot of water signs scorpio cancer pisces that was like an emotional journey for you right now it's all about mental stability it's all about the foundation of how to think stable and do things stable so i feel like these these air signs and earth sign people are good for your for your i don't know in your environment or your journey whatever you're on i like this Anything else to say to Libra? One last card, please, for Libra. Yeah, the star card. It was in reverse. It's in reverse. So if you were lacking some type of creativity or inspiration, or if you were just feeling fucking bored and you wasn't feeling inspired to do anything, I, I feel like something's about to change. You're going to feel inspired. You're going to feel good. You're going to feel happy. Something's going to instill hope in you. Okay. I'm getting, I'm getting, you could have been focused on, on so much negative shit. So negative shit was happening to you. You're going to experience a turnaround. You're going to start seeing good things happen. I'm getting some of you are off your wheel. Yeah. Um, King of swords in reverse. Yeah. Like I feel like you were routinely going through negative things or thinking negative or doing things without logic or something like that. But I feel like that's all done. I feel like someone here, I feel like this, if this was you, Libra, you were just doing something because you weren't, you were mad, you were angry, you were upset, or you just wasn't in a healthy mind state is basically what it looks like. I'm also getting, if somebody's grandmother is sick, she's going to get better. I feel like she is going to get better. I don't think it's long-term better. Like she might be better today, tomorrow. And with the star card in reverse, there's still long-term issues with her. But I do see something not being over just yet. That's what I got for you. Okay, Libra?